In this episode, I'll show you how I start my character design and how I break the bad habits of drawing the same thing over and over and create fresh designs. Characters are created hand in hand with the story. When you have a rough idea of the story you want to tell, you can start designing the characters that will occupy that setting. Many professionals still begin the rough design process with paper and a pencil because they believe they can get ideas out quicker and they don't spend time undoing mistakes or fixing corrections that a computer would allow them to do. Some of my more interesting designs come out of a slip of the pencil where I see something that didn't intend to be there in the first place. Before I start drawing characters, I gather some references and have them around when I start to play with different ideas. These can be simple things like types of hairstyles or clothing that would be prominent design in the character. I start my designs by creating the character's head. After I've drawn five or six designs, I see if there's a pattern that I keep drawing or a similar shape that keeps coming up in the designs. Then I draw other basic shapes to break the habit and draw new and old features on these simple shapes. After I've found a few drawings I like, I copy them and squash and stretch them to see if there's something more appealing in the distortions. Sometimes I squash and stretch everything. Sometimes it's just a feature, like the nose or the eyes. Cartoon characters are always more appealing when they have exaggerated features. Sometimes it's not the features in the face, but the size of the head in relation to the body, the length of the limbs, or sometimes exaggerated clothing. In the next tutorial, we'll work on designing the bodies for our characters and render them. So subscribe and stay tuned.